A student was upset after seeing another student wearing a backpack with a Confederate flag patch. That student then recorded it, and now the video is going viral. Good evening, and thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Adrian Moore. I'm Sam Shane. This video has outraged a local mom who is now calling on the district to be more vigilant in enforcing school policies. CBS 13's Angela Masalam is live now in Elk Grove with the story. Angela? Yeah, it was just another normal school day for high schoolers here at Elk Grove High, but just a few days ago, it was anything but normal when one student filmed another student who was carrying a backpack with a Confederate flag patch on it. Sad that we continue to have to be faced with these kind of images and reminders of America's ugly past. Sonia Lewis was outraged after her son showed her the video taken by his friend at Elk Grove High, a student on campus carrying a backpack with a patch of the Confederate flag. I'm a history teacher, so when, when the North and the South were fighting each other in the Civil War, it was a flag to unite the Southern states under the auspice of slavery. Lewis says she called the Elk Grove Unified School District to report the video and says she was told the student in question may not be part of their district. But the district confirmed to CBS 13 the student does attend Elk Grove High. We spoke to Elk Grove Unified on Wednesday and asked about its school policies and restrictions. Should uh, the site administration predict that, um, you know, have some kind of um, reasonable prediction that uh, there would be a disruption on the campus due to some kind of dress code violation, um, then they will act accordingly. Pinkerton says if there's no issue with what a student is wearing at school, there's usually no action taken against them. You can tell me that nothing's been violated from that video. As far as I understand, there's been no disruption at the campus. Sac City Unified has the same policy. Administrators there say as long as there's no disruption in the classroom or among students, there's nothing the school can do. But with recent events like the rally that turned violent in Charlottesville, a spokesman for Sac City Unified is weighing in. If we saw something like that in our school district, we would definitely use all of the tools and the authority we have to address that issue. Lewis says that's not enough. She says the line between hate speech and hate crimes is blurred. She wants school districts like Elk Grove Unified to establish boundaries before things get out of hand. My wish for the future is that my kids' kids don't have to deal with this kind of stuff. Now, according to Elk Grove Unified, the students involved in that Snapchat video were all spoken to by school administrators. The district, though, wouldn't say if there was any action taken against the student carrying that backpack. All right, very interesting. Angela Musalam reporting live for us in Elk Grove tonight. Thanks so much.